We're now hearing from the family of the car salesman who was kidnapped and stuffed in a trunk during a test drive. He even confronted his attackers after he escaped. Jose Martinez is out of the hospital and is expected to be okay. His split-second decision-making may have saved his life. Channel 2's Brandon Walker joins us live from the dealership off the Beltway and Southwest Freeway. Brandon, you spoke with his family. How is he doing right now? Well, he's doing all right, Sarah. No other way to describe this ordeal than incredible. Jose Martinez currently has his nose broken in four places. His jaw is swollen. He's having a hard time talking because he had the fight for his life. And this all started here in the parking lot of the car dealership doing what he does every day. No doubt his mother's a happy woman. We spoke to her just a few minutes ago. That's your little boy. Melissa Martinez has a lot to smile about when it comes to her little boy, her youngest son, 22-year-old Jose Martinez. He, he did good. That, that's all I can He did really good. Damn good. You see, Jose's quick thinking likely saved his life. He was at work last night. He's a salesman at the Gilman dealership on the Beltway, where it meets Southwest Freeway. Mom Melissa says what seemed like a routine test drive turned out to be anything but. When did he notice a car following them? And then once he told the gentleman to turn a certain to un, in a certain street, and he didn't, he kind of put two and two together, and he goes, you know, something's going down. Jose and who he thought was a customer were test driving a red Dodge Challenger. His mom says another car followed. Both cars came to a stop. Three men, she says, beat Jose and threw him in the trunk. Jose wasn't going down without a fight. He outsmarted his captors, pulling the release latch in the trunk. He got out. And the fighting continued. While he was fighting, one of the, one of them had a gun, and it uh, he dropped it, and Jose picked it up, and and shot him. So he shot him. Mm -hmm. Where was he shot? Do you know? In the neck. Jose ran for his life, but his smarts were still at work. While in the trunk, he called a friend. He also turned the tracker on his phone. That led police to the car here at South Derry Ashford Road. His kidnappers got away. He was pretty badly beaten. Mom Melissa says Jose is recovering at home, likely because of his quick thinking. That's Jose. That he, I mean, uh, you know, he's he's very uh, fast. He, you know, he thinks of things that you know really quick. Yeah, he's alive and ready to tell his story. You'll see that part with my colleague Mark Boyle. Stay with us right here on Channel 2 News at noon. He's got a one on one with Jose Martinez. His mother says that he will return to work, though, all of this after he, of course, heals from his injuries. We're live this morning in Southwest Houston. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.